Well, we arrived in Antigua, having left Martinique um, on the 8th of May. And um, the photograph you see is Jolly Harbour. Um, we had to check in. These photographs, in fact, are some the same day and some the following day. Um, but we had to check in, and the check-in there is just horrendous, it, really horrible. Very officious, very regimented, several different people you had to see. Not good. Not a good experience out of all the islands and checking in. This is uh, Jolly Harbour, Antigua. Those are the houses, look rich and wonderful, with boats, moorings outside. Uh, eye watering, there's a local cafe. And over here is the Immigration Port Authority. And over there is the yard. And uh, looks like we're getting ready to check out. Um, there's our dinghy there. Sorry, I said when I said check out, I really meant check in. <laughs> yeah, we're checking in. That's a plava, by the way. It's one of the most complicated systems that we come across here. Yeah. This is the, uh, the big Egypt. We have like the largest border in the city. It's a stretch off. Apparently, it's like. 600 meters deep for like, I don't know. found a few restaurants street around Jolly Harbour but it's very expensive it's not my favorite place um, where we followed the next year if you look you'll find this we transatlantic the 2024 as well we found a slightly better experience um, but anyway uh, looks, everything was very fairly shut as well when we arrived or well, hadn't been opened yet quite expensive okay so we're walking to a local restaurant and Anthony's moaning in my right ear about the fact he's too young to walk that sort of distance. Um, it's about six o'clock at night and Milan's behind us and this is a selfie, I think you call it. The last restaurant before we set sail tomorrow morning. Uh, tomorrow we've got to uh, check out and then we've got to get fuel and we're going. 